Don't be a dummy. Give them your money. Mom, this is an intervention. We love you. We all support you. But your manner of raising me has been too strict and too harsh. Like my new tutor. Learn! 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 Are you learning yet? I don't know. Did Caligula get his comeuppance? Good! It's working! Learn! 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 I know that you love me, but it seems your only way of expressing it is theoretical math and organic chemistry. So please, put the tiger mom back in the cage, and then maybe dad will come home. Tiger! And that's why we're on the lookout. But it kinda seems like you've got another thing going on. We are the Spice Boys. So stop and move over, because we're about to spice up your life. I am Spice. Hey, name Vinegar. And my name is... is Tard. Excuse you? Like mustard! Come on, guys, please don't make a big deal out of this. It's cultural, okay? I shorten vinegar all the time, but you don't hear me calling myself... Vinny! Damn it, you're going to get us in trouble again. Don't make us kick you out like we did with Baby Spice. Whenever I go out of town on business, I like to do my research on where I'm going. What are the local hotspots, the bar scene, need to consent, make the best of my time, you know? And I'm Anima! It's an older reference, sir, but it checks out. Wait, is that Garlic Jr.? Weren't you trapped in another dimension never to escape? Yes, I escaped. Oh no! Right! And now, I've captured Kami and released the Blackwater Mist upon the planet. It's actually something Popo's been fermenting for the last couple hundred years. He says it's great for vape pens and butt chugging. Yeah. And now, with the help of the Machio Star, we're going to wipe out all of the Earth's defenses. Please, we got Piccolo, and he beat up second-born Frieza. What are you gonna do? Oh, great. So he's all bath salts now, too. <laughs> Time to get the shit out! Go on! Fuck! You and I are gonna have a real gas. The long-term effects of mustard gas on soldiers in World War II was horrific. Why would you- By the way, it was World War One. Right, I know, you just, like, you start saying World War and you just kind of want to say two, you know? It's like with Terminator. Everybody knows there's a first one, but everybody's always talking about the sequel. Ah! Dylan! Oh my god, are you okay? Man, I'm glad we skipped this the first time. Well, where's Vegeta? He can help us! Apparently he went out to space to find your dad. All right, I've checked everywhere except for planet Yardrat and Vampa. Wait a minute, am I floating in space? Man, I guess it's a good thing I'm in a part of galaxy where there's air. So I told you, bitch! Don't worry! Wipe them all up in your guts! You gotta feel fresh and clean! Ah! Holy shit! Anima! No! I mean, we actually hated him, so I'm not really heartbroken over it, but I've been using his HBO Go account, and while I'm not into Game of Thrones, I'm really enjoying Silicon Valley. Ah! Fuck! Holy shit, Johan, did you just kill two people? I now have a taste for blood. Why do you like that, though? Spice, release the cokehead. Sick him, boy. Guys, what should we do with this scene? <laughs> we should do a dodge joke. We haven't done one in forever. People fucking love them, and we made the goddamn show. We fucking do it! Maybe... I don't know, Kurt, what do you think? All right, Judge Jug it is. Fuck yeah! Dodge! Good, now choke him. Choke the shit out of him. What? Bro. Jesus, what? Fighting, harder, Mr. Piccolo. Oh, thank Kami. Good, good. Back to the choking then. Ah, oh, it's weird now. Made it weird, Gohan. <laughs> now I'm hungry. Wait, wait, wait! <laughs> Please, Mr. Piccolo, 
Don't let the black water miscontrol you. No, no, no. We, we gave him cocaine. Did you not hear us? What? It's a spice. Spice of life. Mr. Popo leaves it lying around. I made French toast the other week and it was a bad time. Well, at first it was a really good time. Very productive day, but then it wasn't. I want some coke toast. <laughs> All right, Piccolo, make like an anti-vaxxer and murder this child. Getting a little heavy-handed with the social commentary, aren't we? No, art should be controversial, man. Actually, hold on. Want to see something gross? I don't really do gross. <laughs> oh, God, guy, what are you... Oh, oh no, 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 I, I, I can't, I can't do gross. I, I gotta throw up. I gotta throw up. <laughs> hey, Vinny, I think the coke's warm. <laughs> More! I need more! All right, man. Jesus, I I'm sure there's more around here somewhere. Ah! No! My cocaine! Mr. Piccolo, I've had one intervention today, and I, I will not have another. Ugh, okay, this place is killing my high. I'm out. Are you fucking me right now? You know what? Fine. I'm a strong, independent demon who don't need no henchmen. <laughs> Imagine my slong in this form. Mm. Oh god, he's giant and immortal. There's literally no way to defeat him. That's right, fuck boys. Now behold, the terrifying abyss that is the dead zone. For banishing me before, you shall suffer that same gruesome fate forever. And... Wait, did I? I just did it again, didn't I? I literally just did the exact same thing that got me an L last time. What am I doing? This is exactly what my therapist told me not to do. We're very proud of you for seeking help. I'm doing it for me, but I appreciate the support. Anyway, nobody move. Nobody do anything. I'm going to close it up, and then I'm going to let my immortality wear you down and... <laughs> Kept you waiting, huh? <laughs> What did I just watch? I mean, dream. Wow. I certainly wouldn't like and subscribe to that. Or hit that bell icon to stay updated with notifications. Definitely wouldn't check out any Patreon either. No sleeping during your lessons! Learn! 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 Hello. You're listening to ZPR. I'm Carlene Morrigan. And tonight, we're joined by Vinegar, author of this year's best-selling novel, The Fault in Our Macchio Stars. Now, in this book, you refer to yourself as the big, dumb, stupid one. Why is that? Uh, because of the time, that's the role I made for myself, you know? Or rather, allowed other people to make for me. <laughs> Too often we fall into the preconceptions laid out by society because we don't know anything else, right? And that's what this book is about. It's about changing who you are and, hopefully... You know, those around you. And do you feel bad about all the people you massacred in your conquest throughout space? Uh, to paraphrase Alexander Pope, if I may. To err is demon, to forgive divine. And I believe we are not the sum of our past mistakes, but rather the direction of our future. Wise words from not a big, dumb, stupid man. Thank you, Mr. Oh, wow. Um, it's Vinny, actually. <laughs>